But hey guys, in this quick video tutorial today, I'm gonna to show you how to do the automatic local date and timestamps in Discord. So let's go. So first up, you wanna to go to this website and choose your desired Discord timestamp. For me, I like the long date and timestamp format, and this is the input that you'll need for Discord. You can copy and paste this now, and don't really worry about the numbers um, in between, because you'll be replacing that very soon. Paste that into Discord, and that's your format right there. Next up, you can use either one of these two sites, this Epoch Converter, or also this site as well for uh, your date and timestamp. For this website, I've gone ahead and entered in my date and timestamp already, and I've chosen my local time, which is GMT plus seven. So this is all correct. I hit human date to timestamp and this is my timestamp here. And this is exactly what I want here in the long format. So what I can do now is go and just copy that um, timestamp into Discord. So I'll just go in here and just replace that and just keeping the format exactly the same. And there you go, that is now relative to my local time, which is what I want. You can also use this website as well, which is very similar as before, but it's very convenient that it has the time format in this as well. So you can copy that straight away. But the only difference is that you can't select your starting local relative time. So this will be the same um, time for everyone else. So if you enter that in now, this will be different because you're not selecting your local relative time at the start. And that's it for this quick video tutorial. I hope it helped. I'll catch you guys in the next one. Cheers and see ya.